Alright, what's up everybody? Once again, it's Brand Man Sean, and today we're going to go over how to create your own hype and accelerate into the big leagues, the Playboy Cardi way. And I'm doing this video because somebody asked me to do a Playboy Cardi video, but I can't remember who it was. If you don't know who Playboy Cardi is, he's the artist currently associated with ASAP Worldwide. You know, ASAP Rocky, ASAP Barry, and all them. Number one, confidence. I know this sounds a little weird, but if you hear a lot of people talk about Playboy Cardi the first time they met him even years ago, he had a lot of confidence. When he walked in a room, you could feel it, you could see it, and that's kind of a part of that X factor that I went over in one of the How to Get Signed videos. Legitimate confidence is such a rarity that people are actually able to sell it. If you think about Rihanna, the core of her brand is actually confidence. Not this whole bad girl thing, but she exudes this confidence, this X factor thing that so many artists don't really have. I'm not trying to compare her to Beyonce, but even in comparison, she just has this thing about her, this aura that's just larger than life. And it creates that X factor. Confidence creates an X factor feeling. That could open some doors for you because people can't figure you out and they just want to be around. Number two is the most important though. Connections and associations. Playboy Cardi, he's known Ian Connor for years. Back when he was in like high school, he known people in Awful Records. If you don't know Awful Records, they have big artists like, like Father, he's the biggest name. There's also Abra. And although he probably didn't use, plan to use these relationships for rap at first, when he first started to know these people. But fortunately for him, he had that great fortune of being around these people and two systems that were actually already winning. When he was messing with Awful Records Heavy, he was basically like the little brother and all these artists that are already winning or the system's moving and taking off and all, some people already have millions of views, etc. When that system's already moving and you're around that and you have these people teaching you the game or helping take care of you and also around you so they're basically giving you additional credibility, it creates this additional aura around you, this additional branding around you that makes you look official. Once again, it's organic and kind of by chance for him, but if you can find a group that you really mess with, you like the way they move, and you could be around them because they already have a system that's already winning, it can do wonders for your brand and help you get past a lot of the BS. But number three, have a legitimate hit song. In Broke Boy, Playboy Cardi had a legitimate hit song. Whether some people like it or not, there was a huge following and huge like for that song. So if you can have this confidence, the self-fulfilling prophecy that make people feel and think you are a star, you can get around the right people and hang around them. And then on top of that, actually have some legitimate great music because he had all these great things going before he really put his music out. He started leaking and putting some things out here and there. But the fact that the huge part of it was he was around Awful Records and then you had you add to the fact he had a homie in Ian Connor, the guy who put Lil Yachty on and brought him to Kanye's fashion show and is already connected with the ASAP mob who's that connected. He had known him already and then he brought him over to ASAP mob. He had the good graces of really being able to be a part of two crews and establish systems that were already moving because he didn't really do a huge independent grind like that if you compare it to most artists. He kind of jumped in some systems and they built his clout and then he capped off of it. Which is, I mean, which you, anybody should do if they had that opportunity. If there's one huge takeaway, if you can find that group, an established system that's already winning will incredibly increase your chances of winning as well and it will take away a lot of the groundwork that you have to do for yourself. I don't know what city and place you are in but if you have that opportunity take advantage. That's it. Hit that subscribe button.